Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rhonda, if you're new, and this is my Sam Pool Design Team Project. Happy New Year too. This is my, my January project. Um, it, this started out, this project, with a gift card box from last year that I covered with a digital from Sam Pool Designs. And I added lace trims and I covered the sides with lavish laces and an antique book, French book page. And I opened, I uh, included covering inside with some sample papers. So here's this little mini mini journal that I made. It started with a an antique book page, French book page, and some antique lace and trims, and a little bit of ephemera, French ephemera. And she's real tiny. Now I took the appliques that I had. Uh, I have, I've, I've shown this before. It's a box I created with appliques in it keep my appliques so what I did was I I took some of them and then I cut out the middle and then that that makes a frame whatever size uh, frame you need and then I just saved the middle part as well and this is a real tiny one and so I did that throughout this little journal it's all sample designs digitals, except for maybe a book page. And all the images of uh, children and women are also samples from my collection too, I think. But I made a little tag. And most of the pages are from the La Patisserie digital. Lazy Day, I have a few in here. And let me think. And here's another tag I made. I just love that image in the belly band, lace belly band. And then this tag. And then here is another of the applique framing the antique little photo. And then this little bird image here. And then I just added a little bit of trim, lace trim on this one. And most of the uh, fabric and, and trims are from Lavish Laces, Gisela. And then I really like this one. This little applique, I cut out the middle and framed her. And this is a rather larger one. I probably have a few book pages in here, but mostly digitals. And then in this little lace pocket, I just have a lace covered little piece of ephemera. This is a tiny book. But I had fun with her. And then you can tell the pages that are from the La Patisserie. Still some neutrals, you know, I love neutrals, but I also love this pink. And I just love this little girl image. Just love her. And then here's a tag of a family from one of Sam's images. And I, I left some room if someone wants to write in this. But I really like this one. It turned out nice. This little applique cut out to frame her. And then in this side tuck, 
I just cut out one of Sam's images and I added the French, antique French stamp. And then here is the other kit I used, the French wage envelopes. There's, they're a lot bigger than this, but I had to shrink them down because I was making this tiny little booklet journal. And, and then I just clipped some sample paper in there that I had. But these are, these are fun. Sam has them in all colors. And although this book barely fit in the box after I loaded it up, um, I will send what didn't make it in the book because uh, whoever purchased this will get these things. I had to take out. The box would not even close. <laughs> I don't know why we do that. We just make them chunky, don't we? And then here's another one of the applique around the image. It just sort of brings your focal to that to that uh, image. And then I love this lace side tuck. I just added some antique French book pages in here in one of Sam's images. So I'm trying to hold it flat and I hope it's close enough for you. And then here is another applique. And then I did a little, just a little bit of collaging on this page. I didn't want to cover up too much because I love the colors of this. I'm pretty sure this is from La, La Patisserie, but I'm not sure. And then there, this one is for sure. And then here's the last page, just the last applique I used, Lady in Her Hat, and there you have it. So I hope you enjoyed that. I enjoyed creating her. Uh, she's a tiny little thing, and, and she will be arriving to whoever purchases her in this little box with these little extras included. And thank you for watching, and I hope you find some appliques to cut out and use as frames. They're a lot of fun. They add a little different dimension to your work. And please check back every Thursday. We have eight ladies on our team, and they're all very talented. I will list them below. But again, thanks for watching, and I hope you found some inspiration. Bye-bye.